Guys, no intro and no letters whenever I give the film a letter grade. I just want to cut to these reviews because I don't want to delay them anymore. I'm sorry these are, haven't been up recently, but I finally, a lot of stuff's been going on. This won't happen again. Thank you for your, for your patience. Well, anyway, here are the, there are annotations on this side of the screen right now saying where the reviews are, and if you want to skip to a certain review, then you can. So anyway, let me cut to A Good Day to Die Hard. I hated this film. I hated everything about it. The writing was stupid. John McClane was not his ca his character. I hated his son. He wasn't likable. The villain wasn't good. The action was boring. This film was an all-out mess, and I hated it. I give this film a D minus, just because when he said the line, it was sort of cool. <sighs> Sorry. These reviews are going to be fast if I have not that much to say about them, especially when I have to rant about a film. I don't know why I'm pointing back. It's like the poster will be back there. But, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, let me move on to my next film, a film I want to say a lot about, actually, Bullet to the Head. I surprisingly enjoyed this film. I thought Stallone was very likable. I thought his partner was very likable. Uh, I found his do I found his daughter to be likable as well. I found the villain... The second villain, the one with the ponytail, to be pretty cool. I thought the fight scenes were fantastic. I had a lot of fun with this movie, and you know what? Walter Hill really brings his A game in the directing category. I give this film a B plus. And now, let me move on to a film I'm sure none of you saw, Escape from Planet Earth. I was not looking forward to this film, but I did surprisingly like it. There was a lot of adult humor in it, surprisingly, and not to mention, there's just one joke, an Aliens, the movie joke, uh, gets me, and you know what, this film was surprisingly fun, but the characters very fleshed out, no, they were stereotypical, but the, the story was pretty, meh, I really didn't care for it, but the humor was fun at times, and that's all I can really say, I wasn't bored by it. I thought having William Shatner as in it was very clever. Um, however, I thought some of the voice acting got annoying. I thought the voice acting did get annoying, especially from the little kid. I found him to be quite annoying. But you know what? This film was okay. I give it a C plus. If you, if you have to take your kids to see this movie, you will not be bored. You will have a little bit of fun with it. And now let me move on to another film which I really want to talk about: Warm Bodies. I thought this film was pretty awesome, honestly. Me and Colin saw this with uh, another friend of ours, and we had, uh, one of them was a girl, we saw it with two friends of ours, and, uh, the, it was surprising, because all the men who we were with liked it. Me, Colin, and I'm not going to say his name here, I don't know if that's okay with him. And then my, uh, my cousin, who was the other person, did not like it. I was surprised, because she's a huge Twilight fan. Which I realized, this film, like, I was comparing it to Twilight before I came in. This is the worst film to compare Twilight to. This film is very funny, the characters are very likable and charming. The directing is very good. I mean, just, the writing, clever. It was an interesting concept to go through the mind of a zombie. And if I stutter a bit, this is very unscripted. I usually get my thoughts down and put them on a piece of paper, but I just really want these reviews to get out to you guys so you can know what to see. But I really enjoyed this film. It's probably my favorite film of this year so far. Definitely go see it if you already haven't. I give Warm Bodies an A-. minus. Now, let me move on. Wait, is that it? Is that it? I believe it is. I believe that is it. Now, I was going to see, uh, Beautiful Creatures, but I decided not to, you know. I was very busy this weekend. I will be seeing a more before the Oscars, though. It just came to my local theater, and you know what? It, I will be seeing that. I will be seeing that. Uh, Dark Skies comes out this weekend. I'll be seeing that. Uh, I'm still trying to beat Sly Cooper. Just got back, so, you know, being that. Um, and yeah, those are all my reviews. So, please like, favorite, and subscribe for more better made, less stuttering reviews. I'm sorry if I stuttered in this, but I really wanted to get these reviews out to you guys. So, see you later.